Hello students. The next problem under the topic coordinate geometry is show that the points 4 comma 2, 7 comma 5 and 9 comma 7 are collinear. So now what is collinear? When does these three points are said to be collinear? These three points are said to be collinear if they lie on a same straight line. So if we have a line segment the points on the line segment are said to be collinear. Now, here in this question, they are asking us to show that these three points are collinear. That is, they are asking us to show that these three points lie on a same straight line. In order to show that the three given three points are collinear, it is enough if we show that the area of the triangle formed by these three points is equal to zero. Because they all, all the three lie on a same straight line. Definitely they cannot form a triangle. So what we want to say here is we want to show that these three points are collinear for which we have to prove that the area of the triangle formed by these three points is equal to zero. In our previous video, we saw the formula for area of a triangle. So, the formula for area of a triangle is given by 1 by 2 of x1 multiplied with y2 minus y3 plus x2 multiplied with y3 minus y1 plus x3 multiplied with y1 minus y2. So, this is the area of the triangle ABC. Now, we have to substitute the values of x1, x2, x3, y1, y2 and y3 in all these places and we have to get an answer 0. So, if we prove that if this area of a triangle is equal to 0, then we, have, we will prove that uh, the three points are collinear. So, now what are the three points given? So, let us name these points. So, let this be the point A. So, the coordinates of A will be x1, y1. This is point B and its coordinates will be x2, y2. And the coordinates of the point C is x3, y3. So, now let us substitute these three uh, these values over here. So, the area of the triangle ABC will be equal to 1 by 2 multiplied with x1. What is x1? 4. So, 4 multiplied with y2 minus y3. y2 is 5, y3 is 7. So, it will be uh, 5 minus 7 plus x2 x2 is 7 so 7 multiplied with y3 minus y1 y3 is 7 so 7 minus y1 is 2 so 2 plus x3 x3 is what 9 so 9 multiplied with y1 minus y2 y1 is 2 so 2 minus y2 is 5 so 5 and so that will be equal to, let us simplify this. So 1 by 2 multiplied with 4 multiplied with 5 minus 7. So that is negative 2. So minus 2 plus 7 multiplied with 7 minus 2 which will be 5. Plus 9 multiplied with 2 minus 3. So what will be this? This will be negative 3. So minus 3. Because 2 minus 5 is minus 3 and so that will be equal to 1 by 2 multiplied with when we multiply these two we get minus 8 because uh, this negative sign will come because plus into minus is minus 4 2 times is 8 plus 7 5s are 35 and this is plus multiplied with minus so minus 9 multiplied with 3 is 27 so now if we add all this so first we what we have to do is we have to group all the negative terms and the positive terms so in that case when we add minus 8 with 27 we get minus 35 and so that is equal to 1 by 2 multiplied with negative 35 plus 35 so this 35 comes here so minus 8 minus 27 is minus 35 so when we uh, see this minus 35 plus 35 will become 0 and so that will be equal to 1 by 2 multiplied with 0 and so therefore the answer will be 0 which uh, from which we 
get that the area of triangle ABC is equal to 0. So hence we have proved that the three points are collinear. So therefore the given three points are collinear. So we have proved the required result. So hence proved. Hope you have understood this concept of uh, three points being collinear. Thank you.